Hello my YouTube friends, it's me again Daisy and for today's video I'll be sharing with you uh, another perfume haul. I know, I know, I have a lot already but I don't know. I really want to have these uh, perfumes uh, to be added in my collection. So I ordered um, four Marc Jacobs perfume. Yeah, so, but before we proceed to the video, first I'd like to thank my new subscribers. Thank you, thank you so much from the bottom of my heart for uh, subscribing to my channel and for those who have been with me for a while now. Thank you so much for your support and for uh, continue watching uh, my videos, for commenting, for liking the videos. Thank you all so much. And yeah, let's proceed to the video. Um, I ordered for uh, Marc Jacobs uh, perfume, and uh, this thing um, came. I ordered Marc Jacobs this in Dream Forever because I already have a big, large bottle of this one, a uh, full size bottle. By the way, this is a TMN. Um, I don't know, maybe the order got mixed up. And uh, instead of having the Mark Jacobs Daisy Dream, uh, it's ma it's a darker blue. Uh, that's it's the same the same perfume, but the um no no it's not the same perfume. I mean, uh, the bottle looks the same. It's just it's just that it comes in a darker blue bottle. Uh, maybe I will probably sell this to someone else and order the, uh, the other perfume so um, I cannot have this anymore in my collection because I already have a full size so I need to let go of this one and so to, for today I'll be sharing you with you three new Marc Jacobs that I'll be adding in my collection but before we proceed I know for uh, for uh, for some of you who have watched my previous videos you know that I like the Marc Jacobs uh, Daisy line. Not many YouTubers uh, discuss this perfume, or this perfume is not got the doesn't get the uh, rave that the YouTubers the the perfume world is uh, into right now. But uh, because they say that uh, Marc Jacobs Daisy line is. Uh, for the younger crowds or the scent is uh, too uh, for the teens or too juvenile um, the Lada Silage is not so great the projection is moderate or the long last the lasting power is not there but I really don't care I because uh, I love the perfume the perfume house and i love the packaging i love the designs of the bottles so that's why i am collecting this line so for the first perfume that i'll be sharing with you uh, uh, by the way guys this come uh, this perfume come oops sorry this perfume comes today so i don't have any idea i already removed the plastic because to save time and also just to uh, what they call this to lessen the noise and uh, this the, this oh sorry this, this first perfume is um, uh, Mark Jacobs also fresh uh, twinkle and this is a tester bottle uh, I don't mind getting a tester bottles uh, because this is much cheaper and it's also a bonus that this perfume comes in comes with the lid because most of the per, uh, um, what they call this tester bottles doesn't have the lid so for me I prefer to have the uh, lid because of course you can really appreciate the beauty of the bottle because imagine just getting this perfume and just, just sitting on your vanity or on your so imagine sitting this uh, imagine this perfume sitting on your vanity or on your on your uh, dresser 
looking like that uh, it, uh, it that doesn't look uh, appealing to me but when this thing comes with the lid and you, you can appreciate the full the full appearance the full packaging of the, the perfume and um, it looks very attractive right so it's a, a, a bonus that it, uh, this thing this perfume comes with the lid and so for the bar for the perfume for the bottle uh, the packaging is almost the same with the original uh, Marc Jacobs also fresh the only difference is just the color of the bottle and some uh, some flower that is in a purple color as well as for the box uh, test, uh, tester bottle is like just the plain black and white uh, box and this thing is um, a limited edition so there's a thing with my uh, mark jacobs they release new perfume perfume every year every year but it is in a, a limited edition collection so if you want or if you like this perfumes better to get your hands on them right now as uh where you can still have it or can, where you can still find in a um, online stores legitimate online stores so you can you will not get scam like me before uh get it with while you, you still can because maybe in a few years or maybe two to three years from now um it's so hard to find it if ever you can have you can find these perfumes it, it will be very very pricey so as per the smell of this perfume as per the scent I like this perfume and uh, I have a story a little bit story of this I, the first time I saw this perfume um, and watch Kathleen lights if you know her she's a very famous youtuber and blogger and uh, I saw her giggle with with this perfume and how much she likes this perfume and I said to myself I need to have that I I want to know what's in that perfume that makes Kathleen lights uh, fall in love or may uh, love like this perfume and so uh, I was uh, browsing online and then I find this one I saw this one and um, I got this add to cart yes add to cart and uh, this perfume to me is uh, fun I will spray on my hand I will spray right here and the sprayer is so nice um, this perfume uh, at first spray of course I get the alcohol uh, scent but um, let's wait a minute that this uh, alcohol uh, fade away and hmm, this perfume is um, fun huh? and for me it's like it smells uh, fruity sweet and I guess it has a little it, it has some floral notes violet notes I guess because of the color of the bottle probably hmm. and uh, it's like a playful fun uh, refreshing perfume this is uh, good for a uh, signature scent a day-to-day -day scent um, good for the office I guess because it's a light airy uh, perfume to me and next I have nothing much to say because I haven't uh, play or use this perfume uh, for a long time but it's my first impression there's a tart uh, tartness going on on, on on the on the scent that I'm spell, smelling I guess it's from uh, from the fruit or a cherry or raspberry or berries some berries 
berries like that. I don't know. Um, but let's see with the dry down. Next is this Mark Jacobs Daisy Dream Kiss. So it's a red pinkish bottle. This is also 50 ml, 1.7 fluid ounce. And also at the back, it says limited edition and all the things or the ingredients that uh, in this perfume, uh, florals, flowers all over the box. And it says uh, Mark Jacobs Daisy Dream. And this thing is embossed. So is this one. Compared to the tester box, no, it's just like printed in the paper. So, this is how it looks like inside. There is the beauty right there. Oh, wow. It's so pretty. Guys, look at this one. It's so pretty. Um, I like red and pinkish color. So, this is a very, very gorgeous looking perfume like sitting on the vanity how can you not appreciate the design the bottle design it's so pretty yeah let's spray this in my hand how this one smells oh, let's wait for a couple of minutes to so the alcohol feeds This perfume smells um, floral, floral. Uh, just a fruity note uh, that I get. Um, I smell grapefruit. Yeah, the tartness from the grapefruit that you know when you when you cut the grapefruit and then you can smell the skin of the of the grapefruit or orange that's what i get on the initial spray after the alcohol fades away and then i smell a little jasmine or some some floral notes in this but there's the tartness of the of the citrus note that is in this in, in in this perfume i'm not sure if it's orange or grapefruit but yeah let's wait i will give you the final thought after this perfume uh, dries down and next is this one um also the box is almost the same with the Daisy Dream uh, Kiss, uh, well, the only difference is that like, they come in different color. Also, it's a 50 ml, 1.7 fluid ounce. Um, flowers, daisies are all over the box. Uh, it says also a limited edition. Uh, some ingredients, information, and then from the inside, there you see. Oh, this is so lovely I'm so excited guys I'm so happy I'm really really happy <laughs> so nice and it says Mar uh, Mark Jacobs Daisy Dream Twinkle see and the bottle close up right there and they have the same design or what they call this they looks this they look similar or the only difference is also the color and the scent from the inside so let's hmm, let's spray this thing here i don't want to spray in a box in a box because each of us has different body chemistry so uh, each perfume reacts differently but if you I spray this or you spray this on the paper 
it's it smells differently also because um, of the paper composition and something like that uh, so if you're tr testing on a per uh, testing a perfume I prefer to test it on your skin rather than testing just only in the paper and smelling it on the paper I prefer to spray um, on my skin so I can see how my skin reacts to the perfume because uh, there are perfumes that smell sweet on the paper and in the dry down but then when I applied it on my skin for some reason it's a little bit sour uh, it turns sour like uh, like something like that and then uh, it changes over time especially when um, it mix up with the uh, sweat on my skin some some scent uh, stinks so I prefer to to test it on my skin so I can see how my skin will react to the perfume so mm. this perfume also has a strong opening same as this one but it has a citrus opening um it's it smells like um some berries red berries i'm not sure if like the um cherry perhaps something like that and um I smell uh, I smell something flower note that is in this perfume I don't know what it is but there's something floral that I smell and yeah there's something uh, milky and sweet that I'm I am getting but yeah, I like the perfume. Uh, with this three, uh, just a moment, guys. My phone is ringing. So with this three perfume, I'd say at first spray, um, th uh, this one has a strong opening scent, but it's now drying down to a sweet, um, like sweet soapy clean perfume or scent and this one I sprayed right here this is um, milky creamy uh, perfume that I'm getting and then this one the, the uh, twinkle there's something tart uh, I don't know I, I'm not sure if it already dries down but um, there's uh, the tangy strong scent that I don't know what it is but uh, for the price I pay I'm not complaining I know what I'm getting for the, for the uh, longevity because I know this perfume doesn't last very long maybe two to three four five four hours because I have many um, Mark Jacobs also so maybe next time I will give you my full review or thoughts on this perfume just let me know comment down below and um, but for now this is my first impression of this uh, perfumes that I have right now and if you like this video um, please like and share and comment down below what you want to see next or uh, anything that you want me to do in, in the future and don't forget to subscribe to my channel and ring that notification bell so next time I will upload you will get notified uh, and updated so thank you again guys for watching thank you thank you so much and see you again next time bye